Hi everyone, welcome back to this new video. In today's video, we will see how we can use Zen Map for our to gather information about a device or any or any connected device to your Wi-Fi. It so as you can see, I am connected to a Wi-Fi here. Name is Test. So if I want to open, so if I go to Zen Map. Let's say Zen map. Zen map basically comes pre-installed in your Linux machine, but you can install it very easily. If you get any error, comment write in comment section. I will help you. So, so let's first search. Let's see in which range we have to search. So if we do if config, you see my current my current IP address is this. So what we are going to do? So we'll write one nine two point one six eight point one. And we'll go from 1 to 24 in all IP because the device is connected to our network will have the same IPs in this range. The only difference is between the last. So let's say 1 slash 24. Okay. And now we'll see the options of scanning. They are intense scan, intense plus. I'll tell you about pinks. Pink scan is the lowest scan. It takes less time, but many devices didn't respond to it. So if then above it will have quick scan, which give us more information but take more time. So we'll start from pink scan. So now if I do the pink scan, let's say let's click scan. You can see the Zen map is scanning the all over the IP. As you can see, after two to three minutes of scanning, it gives me the following output. So, if you see, this is my current Linux machine which we have seen, which has a 0.4 at end. This is our gateway through which our internet is flowing. Point from which usually same in all networks. As you connect, so these two devices are different. One is my laptop and my windows machine and another is my smartphone and if we we'll do another scan like we as you can see we only have the mac address option not any useful information that we can explore so let's move to quick scan and let's scan it now as you can see have as quick scan is also take two minutes so here are the following output which, which we get the domain tcp IP, and we get ports that are open through which we can get access to the to the device of the target so let's see port 80 which is usually for http which we use in arp spoofing mainly there are another and this is my this is my windows machine as you can see my current linux machine all ports are closed because it's a virtual machine so it doesn't have any ports actually so you can see in my windows machine there is a port 6646 port is open through which we can get access and now we can scan more like we can go for quick scan plus so let's scan it also now in quick scan plus we get more useful information like as you can see here it's showing that target 1.1 is a linux and these all are unknown there is a question mark if it find out that it's coming from a Linux and you can see 1.1 now we can get mission about the work group which is also a 
which also can be explored more. Like all hundred ports are filtered. Like OS Detail Linux host my group. So now you can you can experiment with the all the options like regular scan, slow compressor scan, intense scan. Intense scan is one of the major scan. So you try it yourself. This is a very useful information if you want to get. Get like you want to get the IP address of all connected devices, which you can get very easily through ZenMap, which will help you in ARP spoofing and other attacks. So it is an information gathering application. So use it and write down in comment section do you like it or not. So for now this is all and see you in next video.